We're all set up for an Oscar party. It's 2022, and I think it's going to start at 5 o'clock. We've been watching a little bit of the red carpet. And we're having spaghetti with Godfather tomato sauce. That's to commemorate the 50th anniversary of the Godfather. And we're watching the TV in the living room because we can't get reception in the kitchen. And we're sure not going to eat spaghetti without a card table. So I haven't seen any of the movies for the Oscars, any of the nominated movies. And we don't, we have no idea who these actors are. I hope I'm not blocking them. No, you're not bleeding out. You're fine. We do have two movies to watch. One's Coda and the other is Don't Look Up. They were both nominated. I was hoping to get to them today, or at least one of them, before this started, but we ran out of time. So we're going to enjoy our spaghetti before it gets cold. What do you think, huh? Do you, uh, are you excited for the Oscars this year? I'm excited for the food. <laughs> Okay. Well, I recognize her. No, is that is that who I think it is? Oh, that's Penelope Cruz. It is Penelope Cruz, huh? Okay, that's one person we recognize. <laughs> it's got to be an old timer. We have no idea who the millennials are. Best songs. Yeah. Here. Movie King Richard. King Richard. Sung by Beyonce. So good to be alive. Got all my family by my side. Could wipe this black off if I try. The Oscars are over, and the winners were Coda for Best Picture, Will Smith for Best Actor, No Time to Die was the best song, sung by Billie Eilish. And the actress, the one for best actress was, oh, she played Tammy Faye, and I can't remember the name. So I'll have to find out more about that. Liza Minnelli made a surprise appearance, and she's in a wheelchair and not thinking too clearly. It was really sad seeing her like that. There was an incident where Will Smith smacked Chris Rock for making a joke about his wife. At first I thought it was staged, but apparently it was real. So I'll have to get on Google and find out what that was all about. The spaghetti dinner was fantastic. And we had half a bottle of Merlot to go along with it. And that's really my favorite part of the evening, that spaghetti and the Merlot, the Godfather spaghetti sauce for the 50th anniversary of the Godfather movie. What a great tribute. <laughs>